So at this point I've got the uh, <clears throat> transmission and engine <clears throat> disconnected from uh, the, uh, the cab, the shift selector, the speedo cable, and mm, some other things. So now I'm, next step is to actually lift the engine and the transmission out of here. And so what I did was, what I'm going to do is, I took this piece of cardboard and kind of laid it down over uh, these guys here, sorry, to get my, my template. And so, anyway, I just kind of stuck it down into that and then I carried it over here to the plasma cutter and laid it down in a pattern. Can't remember, whatever, whichever way I went. So, and just kind of, you know, mark my holes and mark the outside of it so I can make an engine lift bracket. So now I got the plasma cutter all set up, so we'll get to that. All right, so the next step is to drill the full four holes into the uh, bottom plate of the lift um, bracket. So we're going to use this uh, bolt thread checker here. So tell it's uh, oops, tell it's a uh, let's see, what is it? Uh, five sixteenths. So five sixteenths is what we got for a hole and so we're done and whoops so we got our used a punch so used a punch and I already punched these four holes so we'll take a get these drilled and uh, move on to the next piece Our next step is to cut out the uh, the adjacent uh, hanging bracket, um, and then we'll weld that to the base plate. So we need to cut off some stock for this piece. We'll get to that right now.
Okay, so there it is. Got some welding done on it. So yeah, anyway, turned out uh, okay. So should be able to now bolt it up and lift that puppy out of there. So hopefully next time that'll be on our to-do list. Thank you.